get a free copy of Altium software using the link provided in this video description. When you sign up for an Altium Designer free trial, you will get an Altium 365 and 25% off discount. Hello and welcome to a new lesson. Today we will learn how to design a PCB in Altium Designer. The circuit that we want to build is a flusher with ESP32. We will start from schematic to PCB and finally we will get a 3D view like this. So let's get started. First we will create a new project so we will go to file, new project and change the name of the project to ESP32 and select the folder and hit create then we will create a PCB and schematic files and save it to the same file of the project now we want to download the library of USB and ESP32 so we will go to snap EDA website and download the libraries If you want to know more information about this component, you have to go to Octopart website and read the datasheet of that component. Now we want to install the libraries. Double click to the library and hit extract. Then we will add the footprint to the schematic. Add footprint, browse, hit OK, OK. Then remove the empty one. Now we want to add the 3D model to the footprint. From place, 3D body. and hit open we will drag it here now we want to flip the 3d model to align the footprint Now it's perfect. Now we want to add a PCB library and schematic library to the project. Schematic library. PCB library. Then we will put the schematic to the schematic library and PCB to the PCB library. And delete that.
now we will save the other library at the same way. Now we will go to the schematic and get all the component If you notice there is an error because there is a many component has the same name. To solve that error we will go to tools, annotation, annotation schematic, all on, update the changes and hit ok. I accept the changes, validate the changes, execute and close. So the error is gone. Now we want to convert the schematic to a PCB. So we will go to design, update PCB document, validate the changes and execute the changes and hit OK. Then select all the component and drag it to the workspace. Then we will delete the room and rearrange the component. So now we want to draw the cover tracks between component. We will go to route, auto route, all, and route all. We close. 
and that's it this is the final chip we got hopefully this video will be useful for you and thank you for listening this video is brought to you by Antium 365 where the world designs electronics and Octopart the fastest search engine for electronic parts